Y'all may not be feeling in that word. Hey Lola's, welcome back to my channel. All right, so we have Vegas, Vegas. So Vegas is actually wearing an outfit that I had bought for Logan. But I was like, let me see if Vegas can put this on. So a lot of people have the misconception of the sizes between the babies and the different silicone. And I promise you guys, this is not a know-it-all, let me teach you moment <laughs> type video. I'm just talking about the sizes here for a moment. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, darling. So Vegas is like, he's still a newborn baby. Um he probably can fit some zero to three but i still put him on mostly newborn actually uh he is long he's probably like 22 inches 21 22 inches i don't know something like that he's he's a long baby he's very well proportioned out he has a really big head which i love and so he fits fills out hats he fills out sleepers well but he's not technically like a three to six month baby. He's not a overly chubby baby. And today I'm actually gonna show you guys the reason why I end up not taking him off this sleeper, which I am gonna take it off of him though in a minute and put it on the baby that I intended it for. Um, once I find a replacement sleeper for him because I love how cuddly and how soft he is in this sleeper oh my gosh i was like just holding him and hugging on him because i'm like oh Boo -boo -boo -boo, you feel so wonderful but let me show y'all his little head fall back look at that baby ah. but he's so like his his silicone is so sweet like it's so soft oh my gosh it's so soft it's so soft um, I realized something about myself uh, once I got my Zenday and I had Vegas. I actually got more bonded to Vegas. And I realized that I, where I really wanted the small newborn size baby, I am more drawn to the feel, the weight of these, the heavier babies. So I found out something about myself that I did not know, I promise you guys. I prefer the heavier babies. Well, some of you guys be like, how do you not know that girl? The, duh, you weight your reborns like heavy. Um, well, okay, I don't know how to explain it. So I love the look of the newborns. I love for posing, I love for, you know, like the newborn, like I said, pictures, clothes, the whole idea of a very newborny baby. But I like to pick up the heavier babies, the bigger babies. I like holding them more. Um, but, but, I am, there is a limit in between the two. Like I don't wanna go with, like, I don't want a toddler silicone baby. I don't want a, a sitting up silicone baby. I mean, like I really like the Sylvia Manning silicone babies that came out and I was tempted because I like the idea of for photographs. But I was like, the whole point of like having like toddlers and stuff, if you wanna do role play videos or just, you know, for fun and dressing up and all that, is to be able to be comfortable with it. And with the vinyl, you can do that. Silicone, you gotta worry about hard surfaces and different things, you know, because it's soft silicone and then, you know, trying to make sure they stay up because soft silicone wobbling all over and stuff, it's just, to me, dysfunctional and the things that they have to do to make it function as if it was a reborn just takes away the whole idea of silicone. I'm not gonna pay, you know, $50 million thousand dollars for what I can get for $2,000 in vinyl, you know what I mean? So I'm learning a lot of stuff about myself as I go, and I think a lot of stuff changes too as, as it go too. Like I love my preemies, 
I love them because they're little and you can travel with them. Look, oh, he's so sweet. I, I, I love them for that. I just love, you know, the bigger babies. And they're easy to shop for, actually, too. Um, they get pretty much, like I said, this is a, a zero to three month um, sleeper. And although I didn't think he was going to fill it out, he actually fills it out really, really well. And he's just, I just love it. Um, something else I realized that I love more about babies as far as scope wise is I like closed mouths more when they're sculpted with closed mouths I think it just it's just a nice look but I do not mind if it's a natural if it's a natural look like Vegas Vegas is still natural looking with his mouth open um because it's not like gaping open or whatever um and don't get me wrong if you like expression babies it's okay every now and then we might want us a yawner or a crier because I bought a crier kit so I'm not opposed to it it's just you know but I also realized something else about my my collection right now and one day I'm gonna line them all up so you guys can see and um <laughs> I have some very peculiar babies in my skull uh, I'm in my collection um they aren't the typical, all just, you know, super just serene, plain Jane, picture perfect, model type looking babies. I like babies with character and, you know, real expressions and I don't know. So I'm just all over the place. Do you guys like have like ever looked at your collection like this what I'm doing now or have you guys ever started looking at babies and saying oh my gosh you know a year ago I wouldn't have never bought this type of baby and I just love it I mean like sometimes we look back and we're like gosh you know so much is changing and it's almost like we're contradicting ourselves oh my gosh listen to me I'm starting to sound like other people <laughs> anyway girl but like I was saying, I just, I'm just loving him right now. I haven't showed him in a while. And Ducky is over off to the side with her little feet up in the air. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. But they won't, they won't, nobody wants her to be a girl. They, everybody wants her to be a boy. Look at her. Look, look, look. <laughs> everybody wants her to be a boy. But I don't want her to be a boy. So anyway... My two favorite babies, so I have the best of both worlds, is my Zenday, which I, like I said, 2023, I will have me a new Zenday. And my Willow, which is my Vegas. And my kit is also going to be up in the running up. So depending on how it turns out, baby, depending on how it turns out, that might be my next fave. So... So I got my Nori. Oh my gosh. I can just line up all my babies. Like, oh my gosh. I just, I have been enjoying a variety of babies. I mean, come on. I mean, you gotta love it. You gotta love it. Um, really, really have been enjoying the mix of babies. Um, next year for 2023, I want to explore even more sculptors. So guys, in the comment section, if you would... Please, please, please let me know sculpt name and sculptors um, that you like that's like full body silicone so that I can be on the lookout and see about purchasing them for uh, painting next year. Um, please keep in mind, I will say this and make it very clear, I will not touch a Bonnie Sabine kit whatsoever and I will not um, paint any type of known counterfeit uh sculpts so i i will not only authentic sculpts and sculptors please but yeah i'm definitely excited to hear what you guys are looking at and what you guys like um i do have i will tell you guys a couple that is on my radar um i do want to paint a cali by mesa said I do want to possibly maybe 
paint Mia. Uh, I'm torn on Mia by uh, what is her name? Izzy Zhao. Zhao? Somebody said Zhao. I'd be like, Izzy Zwa. <laughs> Zwiza. I don't know what her name is. Um, but um, I thought about that one. My only problem sometimes is I just, I, I can't get past, and I know a lot of people prefer girls over boys, and I like boy babies, but but the part of, some of the time I don't get a boy baby in certain sculpts is because they give this, like, the sculpt will be, and I don't understand this. I don't understand how they can sculpt a face really nice, ears really nice, hands, feet, blah, 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 and then they get to the wahoo and it's just like a whole Behringer doll or just I mean it's just so fake to I just baby I mean half of y'all are women y'all self look down at it or something well I guess it don't look the same <laughs> never mind don't do that honey we don't want no cow lips never mind <laughs> oh gosh this is the season honey this is the season listen baby what i ain't gonna do is sugarcoat nothing on my channel baby so if y'all got kids and they this is not toy channel these are not little little kid ch listen baby what i'm one thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna say what i want to say on my channel ah! y'all better love it okay but anyway for real y'all please stop with the little barrier of your bodies please come on let's please and then they'll be Ma'am, you cannot be charging me two, three grand for this kit. And I got to look at a barrier body. No, ma'am. I'm going to need you to drop back down in the lower bucket. Okay? And let's work our way up. Anyway, nevertheless, um, just speaking in general, not to any toward any person. And I know, like, oh, my gosh. A couple people going to be dropping off. Unsubscribe, unsubscribe. They don't like me now. Um, and... <laughs> And hey, listen, we all got stuff we got to work on. I know, girl. Don't come for me, honey, because baby, listen, half of these baby need edges, and this one got too much hair. But I'm going to fix that. It's just because I haven't cut her hair, is why it looks so heavy on her. Um, and like I said, it's just because I haven't cut it. But anyway, nevertheless, I appreciate the sculptors. I really do. Because without them, there would be no me, no us. You know, we really need them, and I'm sure it's got to be hard to do what they do um, as far as sculpting. I'm just saying you ain't getting my money, but <sighs> never mind. Um, just give me the little pee-pee, because -pee. Uh, usually that's the thing. Usually if the um, woo-ha don't look right on the girls, the reason why I end up going with the boys, it's because usually they get the boys on a little bit better. Sometimes those is like... Baby, you ain't never seen one of them either. <laughs> oh, yeah, never mind. But, you know, it don't look as fake. You know what I mean? And, yes, they're going to be covered up with a diaper. No, it doesn't. So, for some babies, the face, if the scope is extremely gorgeous and I really, really like it, it's not a deal breaker for me, okay? Um, but what is what it does make me not want to pay top top price because i'm into ch to collecting lifelike dolls and so i want them to look as lifelike as possible and if i'm changing their diaper and getting them dressed i want every part of that doll to be realistic if that makes sense but um now some of you also may have something to say about you know some of the other aspects of the sculpting and stuff that i collect and like i said I don't hold sculptures. I joke and I tease and I, I do my commentary, but I support a lot of sculptors. And even if they're in, they're growing and their work don't have to be super perfect and flawless and whatever the case may be, um, a lot of times these sculptors know where they're at level wise and they're working on growing and developing and I support them where they're at they're also not trying to charge like their master sculptors or artists um at the same time so I definitely um am not a Miss Goody Two Shoe and that's why I'm asking you guys to let me know what sculpts are out there so that I can be more versatile in what I'm painting 
So anyway, guys, I, that is it for today. I hope that you enjoyed this video chat. And we will talk later because tomorrow is going to be a big day for us. I think I'm going to make it a big day. <laughs> okay. Um, don't forget to check out the giveaway video. Don't forget to go back and share that video. Um, I have a baby that's not painted by me. So all y'all that do not like me and don't like my work. You still can get a baby, a free baby that ain't painted by me from my channel. Uh, I love it, girl. Listen, because you ain't got to like my work. Because everybody not going to like my work. Everything ain't for everybody. I ain't mad at you, baby. If you don't like my style, that's, that's cool with me. I'm good with that. Baby, I'm Gucci over here. And do they still say that? I'm Gucci over here. Anyway, I don't mind. I really don't mind. Um, and some of you guys do like my work, but hey, a free baby is a free baby. So go ahead, roll on over there, hit the enemy, make sure you subscribe, make sure you tell all your friends, your cousins, baby mama, side chicks, sneaky links, um, whatever to, 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 to subscribe. Um, and I hope everybody being safe out there, make good choices and, you know, also respect people that I'm, I'm actually having to learn this. Um, some people do not celebrate these holidays. So I have to be mindful of that. Um, so, you know, forgive me if I'm not, you know, every video going Merry Christmas and this and another because not everybody celebrate that. My son does not celebrate holidays. And so he is probably one of the first in our family that don't celebrate holidays and so um actually uh my grandmother's best friend did not either but anyway nevertheless it's 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 so close to me that now I'm more cautious of it um and um some of them some of the holidays I'm stripping away from celebrating too all that is on a personal level but just understand this is a channel it's for general population entertainment fun whatever if you want to call it educational towards the dolls that's fine too um I don't know if I could be y'all educated y'all see how I talk um <laughs> but <laughs> but I love you guys and I hope that you guys are filled with warmth in your hearts and a lot of love a lot of forgiveness and just be blessed. Good day.